Now we're going to show you the classic cutter from Piranha, recommended by TV chef Rusty Lee. First of all, it comes with three blades. I've got the small dicing blade on here, and we're going to show you how to make chips. So there's your potato, pop it on, push it down. There's your chips. Obviously, the bigger the potato, the bigger the chips. So if you've got an air fryer, or you like homemade chips, this makes chips in seconds, because remember, fresh really is, I believe, best. There's your chips. If I'm gonna put them on this plate, just here, look. You wash those, cold water to remove the starch. They're fantastic in your air fryer or your oven. Now we're gonna go from making chips over here. Now remember, it comes with three blades. The big squares, which we'll show you soon, Small squares, what we're using now, and the slicing blade. Now, the same one we made chips with, we're now gonna make carrot sticks. Again, works in the same way. Pop your carrot on. You can peel your carrot first of all if you want to. I haven't bothered. It really is this easy. So if you're having maybe a party, a buffet, by the way, this blade that we're making chips with will also dice. We'll show you that in a second, but have a look at this. You want carrot sticks, instead of buying them from the supermarket, pre-cut, remember fresh really is best. Now I mentioned dicing, let's come over here. If you're gonna dice, cut your onion in half. Pop it on now, you can dice onion quicker and faster, I believe, than even if you're professional chef you know again maybe you go and buy this in the supermarket ready chopped up in a bag you pay a premium for that because it's ready done have a look at this chopped onion diced onion to perfection for a super stew a curry a casserole in seconds it really is that easy let's do one more let's go over here now the same way we made chips Remember, we put potato through. The same way we made carrot sticks, we can add in cucumber. In seconds, you put this with hummus or a dip. There's your carrot sticks. No, they're not. They're cucumber sticks. In seconds, that's one blade that you get, remember, with your Piranha Classic Cutter. Now I'm going to show you some more. So let's show you some more ideas. Now we're gonna still use the small dicing blade, as you can see here. This is the one that we made chips with, but instead of putting a big piece on, if you put a smaller piece on, now you get a dice, as you can see. You can do more than one if you want to. That's important up to you. I'm gonna do onion. You've already seen how easy it is to dice an onion. But if you wanna do something a little bit softer, like a tomato, don't put a whole tomato on. Cut it in half, but put the skin side up. Now, you can dice a tomato. So this is perfect for all of those salads you might want to make for the summer, for the parties, for the barbecues and the dips. In fact, just have a look at this here. If I put this onto the plate, you really can eat the rainbow with all of the different colors of fruits and vegetables that you can chop in your Piranha Classic Cutter. But let's move over here. So let's go from summertime, let's go to wintertime. Maybe you want to make a soup or a stew. You know, slice carrot, then if you put it onto here, and I'm gonna do two or three pieces at a time, this will now dice your carrot. So the base, remember to most soups, stews, casseroles, is carrot, celery, and onion diced. You decide what goes in your recipe because you're, remember, in charge. If there's something that you don't like, don't put it in. It really is that easy. Give it a little bit of a shake. That's now ready to go straight up into your pot or your pan for your soup, stew, or a casserole. Let's move over here. Let's do more. Maybe you want to make an omelette. Maybe you want to dice peppers for your omelette. If you put mushroom on here, I don't have any mushroom to show you today, but you can do mushrooms in here, perfect. With your peppers for your omelettes, 
In seconds, you can dice a white variety. I'm gonna do radishes a lot, not just one, we'll do a couple at a time, just so you can see. You can dice a wide variety of fruits and vegetables in seconds, and it really is as easy as putting your fruit and vegetable on the grid. Remember, you get the three different slicing and chopping blades, which I'll show you in a second, but just how quick this is. Now, this has got a canister or a container here, I should say, which is two and a half litres inside. All dishwasher safe, incidentally. But have a look at this. A dice of fresh peppers and radish in seconds with your piranha classy. Cool. Let's do one more. Let's do one more. Now, we haven't done fruits yet. I've got pineapple. This could be mango. This could be... Apple, perfect to do apple top for a salad. This could be kiwi fruit. Anything that you want to dice in seconds, you know, if you want to put this in your lunchbox to take to work, for the children to stick to school. You know, you might go and buy that freshly chopped pineapple from the supermarket in that container that's ready done. How much does it cost? It's certainly more cost effective to do it yourself. And remember fresh, as we always say, piranha is best. So now we've changed from the small blade to the ones with the big squares in, the bigger blade. Obviously if the small ones do small chips, the big blade does big chips. Top tip by the way, always wet the blade before you put it into your machine, because what that does then, that makes it slide through easier so if you want potato wedges you can do potato wedges you can do carrots in here in look at the size of those for chips and again like i said earlier if you've got an air fryer and you love potato chips instead of buying them from the supermarket in a bag bigger the potato the bigger the chips in seconds it's that easy remember the one with the squares if we go down here will also dice. So the one with the small blade will give you a small dice. The one with the bigger blade will now give you a bigger dice, as you can see. So they're very similar. They work in the same way. It's just the amount of squares and the size of the squares that differ. So you can get big sticks of cucumber for bigger dips. You can do big uh, chips in there or you can do big carrot sticks, but you want a coarse chop of an onion. You can do that in seconds. So that's your bigger blade. And finally, you also get the smaller slotted slicing blade. Now this is only for soft fruits and vegetables. I've got cucumber in here as well. But if you want to maybe slice melon, pear in here, in exactly the same way you can also slice mushroom, have a look at this because every one of these is the same thickness so they all as you can see are identical and it really is that easy to use so you've seen all the three blades you slice you dice you chop you chip whatever you want this is your classy cutter remember recommended by celebrity chef rusty lee you get the machine, you get three blades, you even get a little cleaning comb included with it as well. Go get yours right now, check out on the internet or go to piranaproducts.co.uk. That's your Piranha Classy Cutter.